Uh, yeah. Hi. How you doing, guys? It's Gavin here from Hologram Productions, and congratulations because you've made it all the way to video four. Videos one to three, how to make music like Burial, and now we're going to learn how to take all of those inspirations and make a remix in the style of whatever. You want one-on-one -on -one tuition or a personal tutorial, then contact me on this email immediately. Now, let's launch straight into changing the... These are the original drums. I swapped the homemade kick for a meaty garage kick, beefed it up using a drum bus, and making some minor tweaks to the EQ. And now I'm just going to draw out a slightly different pattern to last time. Yep, that sounds cool and breakbeaty. I like it. A traditional snare on the two and the four. I'm feeling a rim shot. Glue it down a bit, roll off the lows. Two rim shots layered together, a clap for a third layer, nice and punchy. These are what the hat sounded like originally, a more traditional hi-hat pattern with some off beats. Same sample though, but I'm going to use a different part of the sample. Yeah, that's better, it's louder, punchier. Sixteenth hats for more groove. Let's choose the best part of the sample. Which part will I choose? I quite like this bit. Cool. Offbeat rims. Beep, beep. That's cool. Roll off the highs of that sound. Nice. The kick needs a low end call and response, so I need to create a tom using the same kick, take all the notes and drag them forward one beat, and then roll off the lows. And together they sound like this. But let's just remove some of the notes we don't need. Yeah, lovely swing. Let's add some texture to the offbeat kit using grain delay. It's faint, but it definitely has an effect in the background. Some bus processing, compression, saturation, and OTT. I need to make the 16th hats less present, so I'm gonna put an auto pan chop. It's like a side chain compression. Cool, now we need to change the I decided to use the warmer pad preset on the Juno 106, a Roland instrument. Same chords exactly as the previous video, slightly different reverb, endless arctic, glue it down using glue compressor. Now I'd like to make changes to the, the MIDI clip from the pads and keep the low notes, this will be our bass. This is a sine wave, we want sawtooth, a small amount of attack and release, classic unison, seven voices and 73% amount and with the sub turned on. Make sure the bass is in mono, and then we're going to make some glides. Using that note up here, it creates a glide, cool. Second bass for the breakdown is gonna be a pluck bass, using the same notes, except in sixteenths. No attack, no release, and use the envelope to make a bump, bump, bump sound. Lovely. Let's fast forward to the boring bit where I carve out a funky rhythm. Now here's the funky rhythm. I love it. So now we need to make really big changes to the I'm using a synth called Monarch, which has a really, really cool noise square preset. The note hits every six quarter beats. And I have a lot of processing on this. Auto filter, glue, grain delay, saturation, and really expansive reverb. Really exciting. I'm gonna use this to make a drop. Upstepping arpeggios, where I open up the filter to allow the highs and the noise come through. Sick. Oh yeah, I also need to make some changes to the... This is the original sound. Put it into simpler and slice mode. So now you can play individual hits. Like a beat. That's cool. I can have it as a response. 
Boss, the original is the call. Nice. Another thing I did is I used the jingling voice. I grabbed the sample, I quantitized it to sixteenths, and I pulled back the transients to create a beat. Yeah, that's good. Now it's time to hear the final arrangement. So now that we've made significant changes to the the the, the and the the track has taken on its own character. It's much more club based. It's really big and exciting and let's have a listen. As usual guys, all samples used in this video are available on my Bandcamp. was fun okay so you get the idea essentially what i did is i took a burial track and i added my own sensibility to it and this concludes the burial master class so don't forget to subscribe bye 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 bye, bye, bye.